Uh, hey guys, have you had much luck with LinkedIn for getting SEO leads? Any tips to optimize our profiles? Thanks. Tried using message sequences, but had almost no one respond at all. Yeah, I've not had a lot of luck with that. Adam's starting to try some LinkedIn stuff. Maybe yeah. it's probably a little premature, Adam, but what do you think? Yeah, definitely. I mean, I think this applies to a lot of it. So what I do, I would try different messaging sequences, but the biggest one is like, since I deal a lot with email, like put yourself in their shoes. What would you want to hear? And the thing you probably don't want to hear is, hey, I've got SEO services. Come book a call. Like nobody wants to hear that, right? And so think about them. How can you make it about them? If you've got a really good article you've written or a video or something that's helpful, try leading with that, right? Provide some sort of value, do something that's helpful for them or give them a compliment, right? That's the easiest way is to, you know, maybe lead with a compliment. Do them some bare minimum research. This doesn't take long, like 30 seconds. What are they about? What are they doing? Um, and then, you know, I, I would say that you don't have to like reinvent the wheel. Like uh, Bradley's got to uh, put together that whole video legion system course. You could get that and apply that to LinkedIn. And I guarantee you that would work. It's just a different messaging uh, platform. So I, I think there's a lot to be done here. I would just really go back and look at your messaging. What are you doing? What are you asking for? And are you making it about them and not you? Yeah. And guys, I mean, you know, I use my LinkedIn profile. There's not a whole lot of tree. I mean, there, there are a lot on there, but a whole lot of tree, tree contractors don't aren't very active on LinkedIn. So it's not a great source for leads for my, my agency, but I optimize my profile specifically to talk to tree service contractors. So go check it out at linkedin.com slash in slash Bradley Benner. And you can go use that as an example. And it works. Um, you know, as Adam said, I use a directory, uh, you know, change your approach up a bit, right? So I, I have a directory that I use for tree service contractors. And that is my front end way to start a conversation with tree contractors, which is my target prospect. So what we do is we use, I use LinkedIn as an opportunity to communicate with them after they've engaged with cold outreach, when I've invited them to um, confirm their details for their free company director or their, their free page on the, on the treecarehq.com directory. In other words, I do cold outreach through email uh, and once I get a, a reply back from a contractor, you know, confirming whether the information that I have for their directory page is correct, or if it needs editing, then they automatically go into a, a pipeline. And then my VAs go scrape all the data that they can find about that company and, and optimize their directory page. And then it goes, once they're all done, then they, it goes into the next stage of the pipeline, which signifies or tells me that I have to go follow up with that contractor to to show them what we did for them, which is a, an optimized directory page listing uh, for, for their company. And so what I like to do is then at that point, send a, I send a, a, a kind of a brief video email kind of explaining, showing them what, what was done for their company page and inviting them to reply back if any edits are needed. And then I also will follow up on um, LinkedIn if they have a LinkedIn profile. Again, a lot of tree guys aren't very active over there. Uh, and also on Facebook. Um, I found that a lot of tree guys are active on Facebook. So we generally will engage with their company Facebook page instead of them on a person like their personal profile. But um, that tends to work really well too, because again, we're not, we're not just pitching services. We're providing value ahead of time, which is a optimized directory listing on the treecarehq.com directory, if that makes sense. So uh, it, 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 that tends to work. I've had, I've had quite a few people, you know, good conversations from LinkedIn from that. Because, uh, you know, people are like, oh, wow, thanks. You know, whether I got clients out of LinkedIn or not, not really. Um, just because, again, there's not a, lot of, not a lot of active tree guys on LinkedIn. But um, it just, it just it, it's been a good co communication tool, um, especially with a different approach where I'm providing value instead of just pitching them. Yes, in my pitch, I mean, once we get the conversation going, then I do actually make an offer uh, to do additional marketing services for them. But it's been fairly, fairly good.